When Nazi forces entered Athens 73 years ago, he climbed on the Acropolis and tore down the Svastika flag. Now Manolis Glezo says he plans to raise the issue of World War II reparations from Germany at the European Parliament. A far-left European parliamentarian representing the opposition Syriza party, Mr. Glezo says he will raise Greece's case with the backing of European leftist parties. World War II reparations have resurfaced as an emotional issue in Greece, where many blame Germany, their biggest creditor, for painful austerity and record unemployment associated with two international bailouts. Mr. Glezos insists that the compensation Greece received from Germany following the war falls well short of the 7.2 billion euros it originally claimed. Political parties and war victim groups have since then raised the bill to 162 billion euros, about half of Greece's total government debt. Germany refutes the claim, saying the 115 German Deutschmarks it paid out in compensation to Athens in the 1960s had settled any damages incurred. No further reparations have been acknowledged, but in recent months Germany has conceded that it carries a moral debt for dozens of massacres committed by Nazi soldiers in anti-guerrilla reprisals during the Second World War. Berlin has instead offered to set up a special fund to foster the memory of Nazi war crimes in Greece. Determined to repair fraught relations with Germany, the fragile coalition in Athens has made no comment about Mr. Glezos' designs. Although it accepts that the claim must be pursued, it refutes opposition calls to use them as a bargaining chip in upcoming negotiations expected to kick off the same time Mr. Glezos is set to raise the reparations request. Antikarasava, Athens.